Okay, after you've mastered the very first yo-yo trick, which is just the basic gravity pull, where you throw the yo-yo down and it comes back up, the next thing you'll want to learn is the sleeper. And that's where you throw the yo-yo down and it spins at the bottom of the string and then you give it a tug and it comes right back up. That's the sleeper. Now, the secret to the sleeper is you want to get a good throw where you get enough spin, but then you want to sort of pad your hand a little bit where it doesn't land really violently at the end of the string, where it sort of lets it land a little bit easier. And uh, that'll let it start spinning at the end of the string. And then when you want it back up, then you just uh, wake it back up by tugging on the string. So you might not be able to do it at first. You know, you'll be like, oh, I, I can't make it sleep. It always comes back up. Uh, one of the problems you might have is that your string is too loose or too tight. And so if your string is all super tight, then what you want to do is you want to just take it off your finger like this and let the string go to neutral. It'll unwind, you'll see it, it'll be all wound up like that. And then you want to just put it back on your finger, your middle finger, the top knuckle, wind the yo-yo back up. and then give it another try. So the sleeper is going to be the key to any yo-yo trick and uh, you want to practice your sleepers and then once you've got it down where you can throw a basic sleeper, keep practicing and see how long can you make it sleep. There it is, the sleeper.